Hello all you awesome people out there, my name is Takira and welcome back to this let's play our Shinran Kagura Shino Reverses. And I'll just jump in here and... Yeah, that's, that's fine. Fine, fine, fine. So, let's continue. We are at the third part of this, so we are halfway through when we have taken about two, three girls with these. But we almost have halfway through. Uh, this will be the halfway point though, because then there will be... Uh, chapter 4 and 5 left for this um, particular group and then I have to find out how to unlock um, Humana's Crimson Scrot thing because I have no clue how to do that yet but um, I think I unlocked them when I'm done here but I will shut up now so you can listen抜け人のやつらどこに隠れているんだ。うん。みやび。何いきなり笑い出して。みやびどうしたんだ。これを見てみろ。さっき月線女学館から届いた果たし帳だ。月線から果たし帳。あいつら。<笑><笑> わたしたちと学園祭をやりたいらしい。先に半蔵を潰されたのが相当悔しかったのだろう。で、どうするんですか。どうするもこうするもない。向かってくるものは叩き潰す。それがヘビジョだ。わかったよ、ミヤビ。
<laughs> I didn't know she had it in her to say things like that, but let's fight. And this will take some time, I can see girls. Everyone wants to fight me. But again, button smashing. And how many will the be? And you go down and Almost there. Okay, almost not there. Hundred combo. Seven hundred combo. There we go. <laughs> I like how she said the, the insult. I'm a sniper, but um, the one thing I don't do is sniping. So, 200% on move. Ah, uh, It's because it's, it sounds like they say percento. But, okay, it can be that they're saying that, but. You know, things like translation and stuff. And level up. How many more? Not that I have anything against uh, this because you get so many levels for it, but still, it takes a lot of time. And And you down. And almost there. There we go. Hopefully, last batch. Oh god, not you. Well, okay, it could have been worse. It could have been uh, the. What I call them? The Kumars. Okay, it actually goes pretty well. In fact, they don't defend against me. Well, that makes it a lot easier. Just well, those are okay now. But they really. I've noticed that they're 
it had changed a lot earlier than before. Uh, well, my plan was to transform, but um, it didn't go after plan. But there we go. <laughs> That's the super thing when you just run into it <laughs> instead of transform, but. My turn! Okay, come on. Button smashing! Oh god, am I already there? What do you think about this? Please, yes. Oh god, I turned the wrong way. No! I turned the right way! Well, went better than expected. I thought you were behind me when I fired that last um, special, but apparently not. So, story. ここ I really want to know what's up with them. Uh, I could have done better than that. Oh well. Level 15. And onwards. Next one. Please. Uh, story time. I never forget that day in the summer of the third grade. Mia B and I lay in the grass, watching all the fluffy clouds, wandering across the blue sky. And we each let out a long uh, sigh at the same time. I turned my head toward Mia B and puffed up my cheeks. My father was an active evil shinobi and worked together with uh, Miyabi's father on missions. Being their, uh, being their daughters and hearing their stories, we wanted to become real shinobi and brave those uh, same dangerous missions ourselves. <laughs> Because that's a good idea. The idea put a sparkle in Mirpi's eyes. We each snuck into our home, uh, home shinobi's room. We try again. We each snuck into our home shinobi room and grabbed an awful, <laughs> an armful of real weapons. Once we were ready, we met up and handled for the mo uh, nearby mountain. The mountains our parents had heavily warned us never to go near under any circumstances. We forgot about our parents' warnings and head up the mountain 
laughing and talking. No matter how dense the mountain path become, we felt no fear. We were armed to the teeth with wheels, shuriken and kunai. Nothing could stop us. Once we found a nice spot, we put down our bags. We readied our weapons, started dashing back and forth between the trees and... In the end, we dueled each other with thrown... Uh, with thrown leaves... Uh, what? In the end, we dueled each other with thrown leaves and praised, persisted our climbing and leaped from branch to branch laughing all the while. I'm not sure I read that correctly, but anyways, thought we had prepared at, uh, prepared ahead of time with wheeled weapons. We were children after all. As soon as it was time to play Shinobi, we long stopped caring whatever what what we were playing with. Wow. Though we were, we had prepared ahead of time with real weapons. We were children, after all. As soon as it was time to play Shinobi, we long stopped caring whatever what we were playing with, was with real things or not. I can really feel sometimes that English is not my first language when I have to read things. Nibi suddenly stopped. She was right. There was a faint Raw order coming from somewhere. As Mia B and I searched the area, a black clump suddenly dropped from the sky. I took a close look, then uh, wished it hadn't. I hadn't. It was made of uh, first together animal corpses, with countless human limbs uh, juggling out from inside, like something out of a horror comic. We were still frozen in shock when it roared and charged at us. I knew what it was next. We were going to die. That monster was going to kill us. My body locked up in terror. All I could do was squeeze my eyes shut. But the pain never came, and the monster cries fell silent. Still terrified, I slowly opened my eyes, then the other. I couldn't quite comprehend what I saw. The monster was on the ground, chopped into lifeless pieces. Mary's father was there, clutching her to his chest. And right beside them lay Mary's mother, or rather, her headless corpse. Afterwards, her father told me everything. I apologized to Mirby over and over again. I told her how sorry I was. If I hadn't asked to play Shinobi, her mother will still be alive. But Mirbi never blamed me. That's when I decided that's when I decided. I'll go strong, I'll become invincible, and I always have Mirbi's back. Later on, Mirbi and I were accepted to Hibijo. In our very first year, we made the elite squad. How simple. We both already had intense training experience. No more games. The training we endured since that day was deadlier if either of us made a single mistake. All that got us through. All that got us through. It was our singularity of purpose. Once Mia be made it into Hibijo. Her drive for power grew even more intense. Mewby was always aiming for the top. Sometimes it scares me a little. I started thinking of her as a sharp, sharp, uh, sharp frame plate. I have to read on. Keep enough to cut, f uh, keen enough to cut through anything, or fragile enough to break. And eventually, that blade did break. It happened while we were both in a mission to ambush and eliminate good shinobi students. All of a sudden, I know my attack, Mibi had her retaliate with blood weird. Empowered by her blood weird, 
she became an unstoppable berserker, even the Yoma had to retreat. But unstoppable meant exactly that. Even with the demon gone, she kept on thrashing and screaming. She looked ready to pull herself apart, as if she might break her own spine. I didn't know what to do. On the verge of panic, I remembered a lesson from Hippodio. Bloodreal. I learned something about Bloodreal. Rack my brain for it, then finally remembered. It's one of the anatomic ninja arts. I never tried it before, but if I succeeded, I could stop the ex uh, excess blood flow and cut off the source of her anger. With everything I had left, I created a seal. It forced all of my energy and aimed my palm toward me. With the power from my hand, I drew the excess blood from Mirbi and watched it dissipate into the air. But Mirbi didn't stop. My strength, my life, was flowing out of my body through my palm. No, I couldn't give up yet. Even if my life ended, I couldn't give up. I forced myself to press on. It was because of me that Mirby lost her mother. I had to save her life to be forgiven. The evil hour around Mirby was slowly weakening. It was working just a little more. I squeezed out the last of my strength. The blood completely disappeared and Mirby's collapsed to the ground. The highly difficult anatomic ninja art had succeeded. What I had, what I had in my heart for Mirbi, that what saw it through. I staggered over to her. She was unconscious but still breathing. I hugged her, not caring that she was covered in blood. But that wasn't the end of the story. She paid her price for using blood wheel. It clouded her mind and broke her will. Mirbi was no longer Mirbi. She was still aware, but she showed no sign of response. She didn't speak or walk or smile. The doctor couldn't say whether she would come quickly or stay in that state forever. After that tragedy, Hibijo Private Girls Academy was rebuilt and renamed Hibijo uh, Clandestine Girl Academy. Oh god. <laughs> Everything around my <laughs> me changed. I felt like Mirbi and I didn't matter anymore. But I held on. I knew Mirbi wouldn't let it end that way. She would definitely regain her old self and keep uh, striving to become the strongest shinobi ever. That's why I decided to talk Mirbi and leave Hibijo temporarily. Luckily, there was a nurse, nursing home away uh, from Hibijo. Mirbi and I moved there together. I kept her clean and fed her soft, nurturous food. Some nights she grew frightened and I held her temporary body while we slept. I swore I'd find a way to cure her, to bring her back. Whatever I had to do, whatever long it took, she was all that matters to me. And she still is. Having her back on the feet now doesn't change that. It's all for Mirbi. Everything I do, everything I am, is for Mirbi. That's the path I've chosen for my life. Ugh, I hate these long reading sessions. さて、僕の相手になる不幸な奴はどこだ? 
若そうだなうわイムチンって超失礼じゃない初対面の人にバカっぽいとか言うかな普通しかも私の獲物だったカズラギチンもイムチンが倒したんでしょマジ超失礼なんだけどありえないっしょ私の友達のアッコだってそこまで失礼じゃないよ付き合いきれないさっさとやろう時間の無駄だあれなんでそんな態度大きいわけヘビジョって大して強くないのになんだってだってヘビジョって半蔵に潰されてるじゃん選抜チームだって全員やられちゃったしおまけに校舎までなくなっちゃうとかマジ笑えるんだけどそれは過去のヘビジョだ今のヘビジョは関係ないでもヘビジョはヘビジョじゃんもう黙れこれ以上ヘビジョを侮辱することは許さないふんイムチンって怒りっぽいんだねそんな人はカルシウム取るといいって友達の瞳が言ってたよだから黙れと言ってるんだそのよくしゃべる口今すぐ塞いでやる Well, let's see how that goes. Hopefully, good because Elsa has to fight the fight again, and I don't want that. Well, that was fun. Some of them really fast. And. Well, at least they're supposed to get an out so I can defeat them faster. Actually, this goes real fast. And... Almost at 100. Okay, that was fast. Whoops. Wow. <laughs> I almost defeated it just like that. <laughs> okay, that was um, something. I can do that too, you know. Time to play. I turn to the video. Okay. Maybe not to have time to the video. Oh god, oh god, oh god. No, 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 no. Please don't defeat me! Oh god. My turn! Whew. That's our closest losing! God dang it, I missed! I already lost, you know that? Why did I miss? That fuck. Uh. 
Yeah, I'll get an F, I know that because I lost. Okay, let's um, try that again. I'm a little stronger now, so maybe I can do it. <laughs> oh, if it hadn't missed that attack and she didn't get me with that. But I, okay, I can always complain, so. We try that again! Okay, first part, easy enough. Hello! Thank you for getting close to me. And... I should just have saved my uh, transformation. Almost there. And then we try her again. Let's do this first. Because that irritates her a lot. I don't want to see the transformation scenes again, though. This works pretty well. That is actually stupid how well that works. I just defeated her by that. Well, that was stupid. Wow. Seriously, that attack. That's stupid. That's what spamming that attack I won. Oh god. どうだ。分かったか。これがヘビ女の力だ。うう。話と全然違うよ。インチ。超強いし。くそ。くそ。これも全て。ホムラたちが悪いんだ。あいつらが半蔵に負けたりしなければ Well, but you can also look at it this way. If that thing that hadn't happened, then Mirbi will still be in the wheelchair. Just saying. Remember that. So that was the third fight. Okay, onwards. Next fighter. So I still miss Mirbeer and her. I couldn't remember her name. Riona. どうしたの私たちは仲間
そっかじゃあここで夜桜ちゃんの口を塞がせてもらうねお姉ちゃんのことは絶対絶対絶対に内緒なんだからあー、okay. Why can't you fly? That is something I really want to know. But. Next. Actually, she's using ice. <laughs> That's a more. Oh, there was one. Ah, <laughs> uh, stop that. What about? Uh, no. I actually like her, her transformed outfit. It's a pretty neat. My turn first. Sorry about your clothes. Also, I can transform. To do that attack, <laughs> it's kind of OP. And last attack. I hope. Thank you for the fight. Okay, so now we only need maybe I think. Sorry. 
絶対に本当絶対に嘘じゃないよ<笑>ようなさでもねお姉ちゃんの復讐をするためにはヘビジョに行くしかなかったのお姉ちゃんを殺したやつに復讐することがリョーナちゃんとリョービちゃんの全てだからリョーナ終わったようだなイイブちゃん昔の仲間を相手にしてもちゃんと任務を遂行したなちゃんを疑ってたのお前は料理と違って優しいところがあるからなだが今はもう信じるよお前はもう立派な蛇女の生徒でそして僕たちの仲間だ Oh no I'm mistaken I actually miss him too I still need the, her sister too I told you guys では、戻るとしよう。先に行くぞ。お姉ちゃん。絶対。敵は撃つからね。So yeah, um, I still need to. <laughs> I t o l d you forgot about her. 絶対いい評価だよね。I'm okay with that. You just pissed me off. <laughs> okay,、uh, story time. Back when Sis was in middle school. It was late at night, and Sis still hadn't come home. I got worried and started wandering around the neighborhood. The only time I shut in like me,、uh, a shut in like me walks outside in the middle of the night where there's hardly anybody out. 
Using only what I remembered from my early childhood, I headed in the direction where Sis was most likely to go. After the rear of Cal uh, Tea incident, Sis began to avoid me. But I never stopped loving her. I keep trying to think of a way to rebuild our relationship. Raindrops suddenly began to fall. Rain in the middle of the night always creeped me out, but I came in anxious and started walking faster. I got to the park where we used to play. I saw sister sitting on the covered bench, but she wasn't alone. Mirby was sitting next to her. It was hard to approach them. They were so close together. I worried that they'd be interrupting. So I just stood there and watched the two of them. I know they were childhood friends, but they've always been close. But how should I say this? Something in the air made it feel like there were more than that between them. The rain was blowing into the breeze. Uh, the rain was blowing it onto the bench. Sis took a handkerchief and dried me a bit off. She looked gentle, then I usually uh, saw her. She was always uh, she was she was always tomboys around me, but for me a bit, she looked really feminine. She never uh, showed that side of me uh, to me before. I felt like there was a uh, gulf between us, growing brighter by the minute, and I hated Mirri for putting it there. As long as I had the re uh, root of comedy, I felt like Sis would never look at me again. I turned away from them and walked back home in silence. Once I reached the safety of my room, then I hope baby bit uh, with all my might. Oh god dang it. <laughs> I hate it when she talks so slow. From that day forward, Baby was basically my surrogate sister. Well, so ベベタンは本当のお姉ちゃんじゃない。本当のお姉ちゃんは。でも。頑張って、頑張って。お姉ちゃんに許してもらうんだ。あの、独り言ばっかりで気持ち悪いんですけど。え私なんか喋ってました。もう、こんな子とっとと倒しちゃおう。Good luck with that. I will not lose one more battle. And time to play. And yeah, good luck by defeating me. Because this goal is crazy. Literally. <laughs> Get away from me, girls. Because I don't like any of you. Oh, okay.
I just did now. Well, on roof. Oh no. Please just die. Thank you. It's not that I don't like you, but um, I don't like you. And now with the Kuma thing. Because that's the worst thing ever. Me up from there. Oh god. How does he do this? He's naming them like nothing. Oh god. She is too strong. Oh god. Well, time to defeat you. And I will do really fast, hopefully. Oh god, she transformed. I hope I couldn't um, make her not do that, but okay. Do what you have to do. I will still defeat you. I don't care. I'm done now. Thank you for the battle. I can live with an eight. Mostly because I can't get any better than that. And now it's Miyabi's turn. Hopefully I can do good with her too. But we will find out of that in just a second. お前の名前などに興味はない。どうせすぐに私に倒されるのだからな。随分と自信があるのです。自信などない。いや、過去にはあった。というのが正確だな。そのつまらない自信が生んだ満身のせいで私は取り返しのつかない失敗をしてしま
私は二度と失敗を繰り返さないもう一度蛇女の誇りを高く掲げるまではなるほどある意味私とあなたは同じですどういう意味だおじい様の悲願を達成すること私も理想のために戦っています<笑>少しおしゃべりが過ぎた行くぞ私は負けませんおじい様のために Well, you will do, or else I can't progress in the story, so yeah, there's that. Miyabi, Aku no Hokori o Mai Kakadeo. Nim no Kaishi. Wow. Are you pleased to wake with shooting me like that when. Still, like, ready to, like, you know, get you or something? There we go. Why is it that I defeat them like nothing now? When I normally have so many problems with them. I have no clue. Get away from me. You're not even my target. Less two. Where the hell are you? Oh, there. You kind of missed me, you know that? Either this team is really overpowered or these Pumas are really bad. Let's dance. Don't talk me, you know that's a bad idea to do. Well, I'm just forming. How dare you! I will defeat you. I haven't even transformed yet, I'm not beating you. Like, really. What did you just do to me? My turn to transform, and then I will say thank you for the battle afterwards. Thank you for the battle. And there we go. Well, 
ハンゾート月線は片付けたか。蛇女の復権も近いな。ミヤビ、鈴根先生から連絡があった。抜け人たちの潜伏場所が判明したらしい。そうか。ついに来たか。いよいよ次は抜け人どもの始末だ。待っ